Welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna to be doing a pretty cool unboxing. Um, today's the unboxing is a Elite 77 uh, SummerSlam. As you can see, AJ Styles Elite. Um, I know I'm a little late on this because a lot of people already has uploaded, like already done this, and I know that and all. But uh, I really don't buy figures as soon as they come out. Um, so yeah, it's gonna be a pretty cool video. Uh, if you can please leave a like subscribe and share this video and comment down below i would highly appreciate that um and please go check out my brother's channel at the end of the um uh, let me try to open this at the end of the uh video because i do put his channel there and i would appreciate if you guys can go subscribe to him and show him love and support these videos are a little weird but they're pretty good content in my opinion you should go give him uh, uh watch his stuff and give him a shot and try it out and stuff but anyways um i'm gonna take a look at the package i got it because i love how the attire looks and plus i you can never have too many aj's as i have a lot of aj's um we have the aj on here we got the true effects elite 77 summer slam kind of box look um right here we got all the info where he was born his weight his height um all the championships he has like the um united states and WWE champion and the little vial there, and then the rest in there. The one that I cannot find is a fiend. I kind of really want him. I don't know if like they only have it on ringside, but we got Ronda Rousey, Viscera, I think. Rick Rude, what's her name? Miss Elizabeth, I forgot. And yeah, she, AJ and the fiend. So as we get the figure out, um, you can see the cool little background there. It's actually more like brighter and blue than this one, so that looks nice. The box is pretty cool. It's just normal summer Sam box there. Wish it would make it cool, but anyways, we got the figure right here. And let's get the accessory out first. All right, so it comes with. Let me move the camera. It's so weird having an elite together. And not a lot of room. Right here we have the OC um, jacket. I really like this because it looks pretty, like really dope. Plus, it's like a smaller jacket. It's not huge. It's perfect. It's not like one of those things that you put around. It's like a t-shirt. So this makes it really easier, I think, hopefully. It looks really cool. Then you got the cool, um, you get this out here. The cool hands here, fully red with black uh, on the two fingers where the, like, metal claw. There with the um, white, uh, white printed AJ Styles thing right there, the name. So those are cool. And then getting the figure out, uh, pretty easy to get out actually, there's no stuff on it. Um, going first with the face scan, as you can see here. Love the long hair. The face scan looks really nice actually. There's a lot of detail in it, as none of the eye and like the beard looks all nice. The jacket here look, um, looks pretty cool. Uh, it's just rather jacket. Let's take off the jacket real quick if I can kind of hard to actually so always the annoying part is that i wish that mattel would just make cloth because it would make the figure sell a lot faster and people would buy it more and it would be so, so much easier anyways um going down we got the elbow pad the amazing phenomenal one there with the open hands as he does that we really need a ultimate edition aj honestly because it would be amazing for his hands to actually touch as you can't really do that um, you got the awesome tattoo there, the belt with the cool uh, freaking deep cows right there, the OC. Sadly, they're not together anymore because they went to TNA. Um, and then this little, I love the knee pad here with like the little Japan thing. Uh, I don't know what it says. And then the one red boot down here with the phenomenal. And then the one here, and there's black um, on the back of it. Looks really nice. This figure's really amazing. I would definitely suggest to you guys to get it. Um, and the one thing is the hands are really hard to come uh, get off, but it's pretty good. Um, I'm very glad. I was actually having doubts about getting this figure, and I didn't want to get it. And then when I kept looking at it more, I fell in love with it. Um, also, these little things right here come off as well. Uh, the little wrist, wrist bands. If I can get this on. Um, an upcoming custom I'm trying to work on. Hopefully, it goes well. Um, if it does, then I'll show you. Um, now, the... Uh, what is it? The... 
poses and stuff. Um, I can move his arms very well. Moving the arms like this, like right here, can't do that. It's very stiff, but with this one I can, so the elites aren't really that well. See, I can't move that, so that sucks. Um, the knees are pretty stiff, but that's okay. It's fine. I just wish I could move that arm a little more. Um, the hair actually moves nice. Uh, it's not bad at all. I'm gonna put this on now. See, that looks good, and if it's easier, and it actually is. It's really much easier and doesn't look as baggy as the other clothes do. Let me take it off camera to get it on real quick. There we go. So it's kind of actually hard to get over its hair and stuff though. I will say that. Um, there we go. Look at that. There we go. That's really amazing. Look at that. Look how nice that looks. Sure, it looks amazing. Now, one thing is it's always hard to put on the other jacket accessory, so let's see how hard that is. I'm gonna try to put it on here. So far, it's kinda okay. Kinda. There we go. Yeah, there we go. All right, so, with it all there, it's really stiff, actually. It's really hard if I can try to move it a little bit off camera. Sorry, I'm not doing most of this on camera. Yeah, it's pretty stiff. It looks all cool if you have it for display, but it's really stiff. It's not gonna be really good to play. Or do figures with oh, his hand? What just came off? Oh, his elbow pad come just came off. So be careful of that. You don't want to lose the elbow pad now, because you're probably gonna be pretty pissed if you lose that. It's actually, I'm surprised it came off very clean. Can't believe how easy it came off. So yeah, you want to be careful when you move the jackets around. But anyways, um, the figure's amazing. I honestly love it. It I will give it a nine out of ten. Definitely should buy. It's a really good figure. Um, I'm pretty glad that Mattel did do this figure when it first came out. I was like, it's pretty cool, pretty normal. It looks okay. And now I'm finally get, glad I have it. So if you did join this video, guys, please leave a like. It really helps out the channel. Like I said, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. Um, also, go follow me um, in my social medias if you want to see, catch up on me or like see my other stuff, content I post on TikTok and stuff like that. Plus, I upload um, customs on there that I don't usually upload to the channel. Like on my Instagram, I'm more active on there and TikTok. So you guys can go follow me on there. Twitter, I am active as well. Um, so I'm active on everything. Um, and I've been trying to make YouTube content as best as I can. So hopefully you guys are enjoying the YouTube content so far. And I appreciate you guys clicking on this video. And you are all the best. Um, another thing I want to say is that my social media will have like a... Uh, at the end of the video, you can see it there. It's going to be nice. Uh, it has all the stuff in my usernames. Another thing, go follow my brother uh, to click right here for the videos and stuff. And... Um, I hope you guys are all safe. Please have a great day and a great week and stay positive. You are all amazing. Thank you for the support lately and I truly love you all. Thank you. Peace out.